हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल के बी एस टेक्नोक्राफ्ट पाइथन ट्यूटोरियल डे टू टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न वेरिएबल स्कोप इन पाइथन देर आर थ्री मेन काइंड ऑफ वेरिएबल स्कोप्स आर देयर ग्लोबल स्कोप वेरिएबल लोकल स्कोप वेरिएबल एंड नॉन लोकल स्कोप वेरिएबल बिफोर वी ड्राइव इन टू टूडेज वीडियो आई जस्ट वॉन्टेड टू टेक ए मोमेंट टू इन्वाइट यू to join my channel kbs technocraft if you like what you see please consider hitting the subscribe button and turning on the notification bell so you never miss a video by subscribing you will be the first to know when i upload new content you will be helping us grow our channel and reach even more people so if you have not already hit the subscribe button and become a part of kbs technocraft family today now let's understand all these three type of scope global scope local scope and non local scope of a variable as name suggested global scope is a scope when you define a variable on globally then that particular variable will be able to access inside function and outside function what does it mean let's say consider in your python program you have created a python file dot py file where you declare a variable and you declare multiple function over there then you try to access that particular variable inside the function and outside the function then what will happen since you have declared that particular function outside the outside the function globally then that particular variable will be accessible throughout the function and outside so in this program i have declared a global variable which is outside function and then i created a function which is called global variable test function inside the function i am trying to print that particular global variable and i am calling this function and i am trying to print that particular global variable value outside the function so till this line is inside function and then that function i am getting called here and also i am trying to print the value of that variable outside the function so this function when it's get called it will print the value which is available inside the function and this statement will print the value which is available outside the function since a global variable it's accessible both the places okay now we run it if we run it we are able to see the value remain same and it's accessible inside and outside let's try with other example where we will try to see a other example where we are going to define a global variable and we will try to reassign the global variable value so how to do that we will try to see this example in this example what we are trying to do that here i am defining global variable x equal to 10 and then there is a function where i am trying to reassign that value of global variable to 20 but before that what i am trying to do i am trying to print that global variable value before reassigning okay so this is my function this is my function which having this statement where we are reassigning the value but what we are doing inside the function we are trying to print before assigning after assigning the value and then i'm calling this function and then again i'm trying to print that particular variable value outside function so if you see this function when you are calling what does it do is going to print before value and after value assigning okay and then this since this particular print statement is is calling after the function get called that means the value is assigned to 20 in this case is going to display 20 because this function this particular print statement we are calling after the value is getting reassigned so i will clean this i will run this code let's see the output so if you see the output before reassigning that means this statement is having 10 because top is 10 and after reassigning that means once you reassign 20 this value is displaying 20 and when we are calling this after this function when we are calling this print then is giving the value 20 now see the 
trick behind this if i call this particular function after the print what will happen since this function is responsible for reassigning the value to global variable and that is getting called after the print statement in the code execution then what will happen this statement will give you the value 10 why it will give value 10 because the value of x is getting changed after this print statement is getting executed so let me run it when i run it i can see the value 10 10 that means this value first when you run this code first print statement will happen this and then it will call my function where it's going to print before and after assigning the print so is before assigning 20 10 and after assigning is 20. so this is about the global scope now we will move on to the local scope as name suggested local scopes are a scope variable which are defined inside a function that means if you define a variable inside a function then that particular variable will not be accessible outside the function for example let me create a function and i will assign a value 10 and i will try to print it and then i'm going to call that function here let me call it and then if i run it here you will be able to see the function 10 but if i try to print it here print okay yes let's say consider x is there so x i'm trying to print what will happen since this x is defined inside the function it will not be accessible outside the function and it will give name error because this name is not defined so if i clean this and run it okay, clean and run it you will be able to see this is giving name error because this variable is only accessible inside the function now we will try to look on that local non-local scope non-local variables are used in nested functions which are functions defined inside other function okay so how we can define it let me try to write one example where we are going to have outer and inner function and we will try to define a variable inside a outer function and we will try to reassign that non-local variable value inside the inner function so let's see this example we'll try to understand this example first and then we will run it before that i will try to clean up this so if you see here i have defined the outer function inside outer function i have defined a variable x equal to 10 and then i am trying to print that value x that means inside outer function this value will always be 10 now inside the outer function i have defined a other function that is called inner function there i am trying to change the value to a non-local variable to x equal to 20 and then i am trying to print that non-local variable value so what will happen when this outer function outer function will get called what will happen the value before calling the inner function if you see it will remain 10 but when you call inner function then inside the value is getting 20 and then it will display 20 so let's run this code and see the result okay so if you see outer function is having 10 value and inner function is having 20 because inside inner function we are trying to reassign value to that non-local variable that's why we are able to see that value is 20. i hope it's clear and i try to cover all these three kind of scopes if you have any doubt query concern please type in comment window i will try to look on that thanks for watching if you enjoy this video and want to see more like it please consider subscribing to my channel by hitting the subscribe button if you will notify every time i will upload new video and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you never miss a things your support means the world lot to me and help me to create more content like this so if you have not already 
hit the subscribe button and join the KBS Technosoft community today.